vain and I just think it's beautiful. At the annual St. Baldrick's Day event at Slanty's Irish Pub, men and women line up to make bald beautiful. With shaving our heads, you do it in empathy for children who undergo cancer treatments. Why should the person who already is dealing with cancer have to put on a wig to look like us? Why can't we go bald and show them that's okay? The reason I'm doing this is because I do have the choice to do this. I could very easily say, no way, I'm not shaving my head. It's like invigorating. It's great. It's just, it's really, I don't know. I can't even describe it. Turn around. Everybody look at the hair. Huh? Look at the women. The women got their jaws on the floor. They're like, no way. I could never do that. A close friend of mine has cancer or whatever, and she went to school Wednesday, so I felt really bad, and I, I felt inspired because she like cried the whole entire day during school. So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna do, because she did, she's did. she been through a lot with me, so I said, you know what, I'm gonna shave my head for her. Teresa Bell also rolled up her sleeve and gave blood for the first time in honor of her friend who's battling cancer. She was surprised to learn her blood went to three patients in the hospital. Oh my gosh, this just, that makes you want to cry, honestly. Many cancer patients rely on blood and platelets to sustain life during treatment, and that's why dozens of donors are giving blood at this event. I always like to donate blood because I have O negative, which is a very good blood, universal donor. So I was like, I want to donate blood this year to help out with the kids with cancer and also help out with people who need blood transfusions. People like Tiffany Santos. She's been battling leukemia since 2008. I received a lot of blood and platelets while I was um, going through the journey of having cancer and I just want to thank everyone who donated it because you're saving lives out there. I just thank you everybody that are doing this because uh, some out, some because of someone, you know, my daughter is here and she got a lot of blood and platelets and I thank you everybody for doing that, saving other kids' lives. Together, One Blood in Slanty's Irish Pub helps save dozens of lives in honor of St. Baldrick's. I'm Nancy Gay reporting.